So, okay, so before the sun sets, what would, um, what's the, one of the best words of wisdom you would tell your kids or your grandkids? Well, one anything, thing I can think of okay. is, you say words of wisdom, I guess you call it words of wisdom. Or advice be sure, of life. Be sure you attend, be sure attend church, and be sure that you stick to your religion, whether it's LDS like you are or a Protestant like I am, it's yeah. so important to don't detract from what your Lord has you to want you to do and try and do it and pray and so forth to do the best you can to be a good Christian. And I, I thought, when you mentioned being words of wisdom, I think it's helped so much. When I had uh, West Nile virus in 2004, in July 13, 2004, I had an accident with a car, not realizing it, not realizing what happened the whole day for the next three days, really. I just totally was out of it. But when I got to the hospital, the doctor took my, the nurse or somebody took my temperature, it was a little over 108. And the doctor said, well, I'm pretty sure it's West Nile virus. But he said, it takes so long for the medicine to work. When the temperature this bad, he won't live through it. The only thing that's going to save him is pray. So you need to all pray with this gentleman, because that's the only thing that's going to save him. So my kids got the word, my son's Bible group at Central Christian, and a whole bunch of people that called the minister at my church and everything. Keith told Keith and his family, everybody was praying for me, and that's what did it, I know, because the next morning, Linda, my daughter, came in. She was there when the doctor got there about 6.30, and the doctor said, how's he doing? And my daughter Linda said, well, I don't really know. And the doctor felt my head and said, his temperature's down. And there's the chart, because they'd just taken it not long ago, and it was 103. He said, well, you must have known how to pray. That's all I think could have done it. Because he said, our medicine didn't do that. We could not have taken a temperature down that fast for less yeah. like 12 hours and a half. That prayer saved him. Wow. So I have often thought, boy, what would people do that had no religion and didn't have anything about prayer when something like that came up and the doctor said that was what to do and they did it, you know. Yeah, yeah. That's, wow. the, that's the biggest word of wisdom I can think of. It's <laughs> a good one. Well, an important one, at least. Yes. Right. Yeah, it is.